we're gonna miss you. Yeah, I'm gonna miss you. Hi guys. You guys are resting on a very tilted area in the car. But too uh, stiff to hold the camera. But we are going on a trip today. We're going to Delaware. We are seeing some gardens They're called the Longwood Gardens. And it's like a really beautiful outside garden area. And then we're also going to um, this like really pretty old mansion and touring that. And Tommy is just loading up the car. We also have Strider in the back with us. We're actually dropping him off at a kennel. Um, it'll be our first time leaving him. And I'm so sad. So I got these really cute glasses from Banana Republic. And I have to get cheap glasses because uh, I break all mine and I lose all mine. But I think this is what you get when you pay for cheap sunglasses because I go to put them up like this, just like keep them in my hair. And the second I look it down, yeah, like that, they just fall right down. And they're like massive and they barely fit my face. But they are very, very cute, like a nice mauve purple blush color. But I'm wearing this, I didn't have time to show you my outfit at home, but I'm wearing this really beautiful, massively balloon sleeve sweater from Blue Sparrow Boutiques. It's so pretty. I'm wearing these braided hoops, also from Banana Republic, and um, sweatpants for right now for the road trip, and then I'm gonna change into my jeans when I get there, hopefully. Wearing my Reeboks also for the road trip. <laughs> and then I'm gonna hopefully change into booties. We just got to the boarding kennel place. It's actually kind of pretty. It's out in this like really pretty area. You see that? I literally have tears in my eyes. I'm going to miss him. We're only gone for two nights and I'm literally crying. But honestly though, we've had him since June and we like, we've had him every single day. We've been with him every single day since he was eight weeks old. But I am, oh my gosh, there's someone sitting in that car. Is he sleeping? I can't tell if he's sleeping. This is actually gonna be our first trip since, what, like July? Yes, it is. This will be our first time since our honeymoon um, staying in a hotel together, which is kind of sad. You have to be very careful with the brand new pants here. Got a uh, orange juice. Tommy got a coffee. Here. Thank you. We made it to the gardens. Oh, everything zoomed in, shoot. I changed into jeans and booties. I have to go to the bathroom so badly. I've been holding it in for over two hours, so. Wow. That is beautiful. Oh, this is pretty. These are insane. It's very, very chilly out. It said it was gonna be like 43, but it's actually like 35. And my hands are frozen solid. So I came here a long time ago, probably like 10 years ago with my Nana and we went in the summer so everything was like in full bloom and it's obviously different now with it being so cold but it's still so pretty to see these gardens to like reminisce so when we came that's where we're going next conservatory the chimes tower is going off it's an okay let's get the chimes tower good you could vlog for once I'll give you the vlog. I can't run. I had to put on Tommy's gloves because I'm so cold. This is the little Christmas section. It's beautiful. It's just so foggy. I'm 
is the palm house. There's palms literally everywhere. Look at that. Massive palm. I'm just taking pictures of them. Do you want a bonsai tree? He wants a bonsai tree. He's taking photos of all the trees. <laughs> I feel like you can't even hear me in my mask. I wish you guys could smell it in here. Like beautiful honey, honeysuckle flowers. It smells amazing. These really beautiful pink and white flowers. I don't know which one smells good. One of them smells and it's like taking up the whole room. This is like the boho deserty plant room. Very like boho vibes in here. Look at that. That is amazing. I think my sister would love it in here. What is that thing back there? That's a, yeah, it's an agave. Oh my gosh. That's a big one. Huh? That's the biggest agave plant I've ever seen in my life. We are at our hotel. All right. You got it? In we go. It's a very cute little hotel room. Nice little working station here. Ooh, bathroom over here. Nice, very modern feel. Cozy little couch area. And then the bed. This is a very cozy room. This is so cozy. Then let's see, do we have a view? No, we don't have a view. Oh my gosh, I am cold. I am hungry and I am very, very stiff from this jacket. I want to show you a little up close of my sweater because I didn't really get to show you before. It's this really beautiful um, like balloon sleeved sweater. I love it. Love the length. I actually have um, a turtleneck underneath because I'm this, I, I get like kind of sensitive to fabric sometimes. So I had this underneath and it was uh, very warm with it. And then I was just wearing these Abercrombie jeans today and my booties are from Lulu's. I want to show you the rings I'm wearing really fast. This one from, you always get in the way of my videos. This one is from Madewell. It's like um, diamonds. It's really beautiful. Then my favorite ever croissant dome ring from Missouri. And then on this hand, obviously my wedding ring. And then I have this newer ring from the brand Filippo Loretti. I have no idea how to pronounce it. I'll link it below. Those are the rings that I'm wearing. Some oysters. I've never had one before. I don't know. So Should I have one? Do I slurp it or do I chew it? You're, you'll just find out. Just put huh? It. You'll find out. What do you mean I'll find out? You don't have to chew it. Mm -hmm. You don't have to chew it. Swallow it. Just got back from dinner. How's your meal? So good. We both got the same thing. We got um, steak and potatoes. Dinner was amazing. And we also just picked up some coffees from Duncan because the nearest Starbucks was closed. I think we're just gonna chill and I have to do these little like back patch things that you put on your back that the chiropractor gave me. They kind of like tingle your back or something. I have to do them multiple times a day, so. I don't really know if I explained where we went today, but we went to Longwood Gardens, it's called. It's like a really beautiful, massive garden um, and conservatory. And then tomorrow we go to a a house it's like a mansion called winterter and um i'm really excited for that just went downstairs and it got some waters but then i was also craving something chocolatey so i got this like chocolate peanut butter cupcake um very unhealthy and then we got some dried mango and then tommy got a kombucha it's the next morning and this is a review. We're gonna go down and get some breakfast right now and coffees. Got a little breakfast sandwich. My makeup is done. Why is it that hotel lighting is like 10 times better than my lighting at home. This has been my favorite lip combo at the moment. I use Maybelline 
lip liner in the shade 118 raw chocolate i just line my entire lip with it fill in your lips too and then i use this lip it's a lip oil gloss it's beautiful it's in the shade dip and it's from their wet collection it's like a really really you'll see it's like a really beautiful kind of like shimmery bobby pink i love it on its own but i also just love it paired with that lip liner did i bring a little too much jewelry for only two days i think so i want to show you my outfit well first my jewelry so i'm wearing these earrings from the sweetest little small shop um it's like a husband and wife small shop i'll link it below they're from touch of curious and then i'm wearing my madewell pendant always wear this same rings as yesterday this one and then i just added these two from madewell up here missouri and then madewell again and let me see if i can show you my outfit tommy's getting a little bit of work done here's his ear pods so he can't hear me okay quick outfit of the day i'm wearing this sweater dress it has like really pretty balloon sleeves but you can't see them um it's from express and i'm wearing this coat again from uniqlo very cozy i'm also wearing these tights which are like kind of um a little bit see-through but i have them pulled there's literally pulls over there and on that side which looks really bad and then i'm just wearing these simple black booties from target my favorite booties oh also a scarf i'm just gonna be wearing this scarf from Madewell, which is very cozy. This is my app of the day. <laughs> I look like a blind mouse. I look like the three blind mice. Definitely can't wear sunglasses with a mask. Wow, my Jersey accent just really came out. It's very nice in here. Have y'all been to a winter tour before? No, no we have not. Place. We are at the winter home and tommy just um did a little research on it a little more research and it's the fifth biggest home in what america according to wikipedia according you to, never trust that according to wikipedia it's the fifth biggest home Ninety-six thousand square feet wow so we just finished touring the house but because of covid um only one floor was open which was very sad and disappointing. We're trying to figure out now what to do. We're thinking maybe we're gonna go antiquing because there's, um, I saw some antique stores on the drive here, but we're very sad because the house was so beautiful. I couldn't film in it though, so I did try to take lots of photos. An antique store. What the heck, it's actually called found? So we found two really beautiful pieces. We found these really beautiful old maps. And then the other one has little ships over there, and I love it. So we're sitting here um, missing Strider, but the place that we dropped him off at just posted some photos on their Facebook. And look how cute. This girl's the next one. <laughs> oh, we miss him so much. We're driving on these really pretty roads back here. All that farmland, it's horses and old homes. It's beautiful. Mm, it's so cute. We're stopping here for lunch. The back of the burner. Delicious charcuterie board. Stopped and got some coffees. Always need coffees after lunch. We're stopping at another antique store. Such a cool room. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. Oh, that's pretty. Love. That's amazing. Oh, look at all this blue and white. This is what we have so far in this little pewter thing. Ford, this amazing, amazing oil painting from the 1800s and we got a few little other things we are back from a very long 
day of thrifting or antiquing. So we started antiquing pretty early and it's now five o'clock. So we've been um, antiquing for quite a bit. That last place we went to was huge. It was actually rated by Condé Nast um, to be one of the best antique stores in the United States, which is amazing. I think when I'm home, I'm going to film like a little haul and put it in this video. Such a beautiful sunset tonight, wow. Our plans for tonight are to just chill here for a little bit longer. I am editing a video right now, so I'm gonna be editing that for a little bit longer and then we're gonna go um, actually back to the same seafood place that we went last night because we loved it so much. So we're gonna go back there tonight for dinner at six. 30, so somewhat soon. We're back. Packing up is always the saddest part. How sad are you? I'm so sad to be leaving, but alas, we must keep trekking on. Okay. <laughs> so beautiful. Very comfy outfit for the ride home. We're leaving. I'm very sad. We're in the car. I'm gonna leave very soon. I have my coffee with me. Tommy's just loading up the back and we are gonna leave between law school and like the raising our little puppy. It's been a lot and we have uh, definitely needed this just like two night getaway. It's just been so nice and it'll be nice to have like a little refresher before Tom goes back to school tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that officially tomorrow. Well, he has a winter class tomorrow. That he's starting so I mean he is starting something tomorrow but it'll just be nice um, having this little time off before we get back into the full swing of things we're here to pick up the pop I'm so excited <laughs> 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 He wants up peeing. How are you? How are you? <laughs> we got him. Yeah. We're so happy. When he first went out because he was going to go out to the bathroom, we kept like calling him and he turned around and he was just like staring at us. And he did not know who we were at first. And then you could just tell it like totally clicked with him that we were there and that we were calling his name. He ran over to us and literally just started peeing everywhere. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to get you out of that crate. He's already back playing with his toys. You love being home. We missed you so much, handsome boy. <laughs> Quickly, want to show you guys what we got from some of the antique stores. So I think I did show these when we got them, but they're these beautiful old maps. So at, go sit down, go lie down. So at, um, at the Longwood Gardens, um, I got, I got this adorable, can you see it? I got this adorable bunny ornament because if you didn't know, I collect ornaments that way when I decorate my tree every year, they're just very like memorable and personal. I got this at, at the gift shop and then I was, so happy to find this. I kind of like freaked out when I saw it. It's the Half-Baked Harvest cookbook. Everyone loves this and raves about Half-Baked Harvest. So I am very excited to make some delicious food from this cookbook. I, I was just so happy when I saw this. And from the antique store, we got these beautiful, beautiful Wedgwood pieces. This plate, which is just so beautiful and so our style. We were very, very inspired by the uh, mansion that we toured. Oh, I forgot about this. We got this beautiful piece, very tiny. It's kind of like weird and whimsical on the, the front. Going along with that Wedgwood piece, we got another beautiful Wedgwood. This definitely was inspired by mansion we went to and then lastly we got we got this amazing um pewter 
creamer. It's so heavy and beautiful and there's like tiny little engraving right there, which I think is so pretty. And for the star of the show, Tommy's piece of art he found. Look how beautiful this piece of art is. It is, um, he said it was actually an 1800s oil painting from England, he said. It's an English painting. It's literally beautiful. Oh, really? It's a spot. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, can I? Yeah. Well, we're back home. Home sweet home. We had the best time. Best little trip. Loved getting away with you. I loved it too. Don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Comment down below. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.